Hello, sugar plums, uh, with the emphasis on sugar plums, as my wife does. Uh, this is the channel Planning Day Eve, uh, and I am um, her husband. Stay tuned because I'm doing a Valentine's Do Planner, which makes sense, I think, uh, where we're going to be um, looking at uh, a hijacking of my wife's planner. Uh, and I'll be uh, sharing some of my thoughts about it, uh, her plans, just my uh, my approach to it. Uh, so stay tuned, because uh, you will be informed for sure. Okay, so the planner uh, that I took was the the social media planner, um, and I asked uh, Eve if she could have it uh, loaded with her, you know, her dates and all the important information that she needed to do. Um, and I would just look over it and add, you know, some some positive messages, some to, you know, kind of like, uh, you know, keep her focused and motivated. So the first thing is, I got this sticker uh, that says, "You got this, girl." And I put it right there on this empty space. It was just really convenient because it was in the start of the week. Uh, and it comes from the, the goals, uh, the Happy Planner uh, sticker book goals. Uh, and I used a couple of stickers from in here. Uh, but that was the first one. And um, uh, I'm a math teacher and I'm very OCD. And uh, I didn't center it and it really bothered me. And I always forget that these stickers really come off real easy and you can reapply them. Uh, but I didn't realize that until a little bit later. Uh, so uh, I left the little arrows there to show her that she needed to mentally uh, rotate it and center it for me. Uh, <laughs> because uh, yeah, it's just the way that I am. Yeah. So uh, then, so from there, um, I started drawing this uh, figure. So this is a, a real personal thing. Um, when I first was courting Milady, um, I used to draw her uh, myself in the future um, and I wanted to humble, be, be humble and I used to draw myself as a obese, uh, balding, uh, middle-aged man um, and um, I think only one of those things came true uh, but that's fine, uh, it's not the hair. Um, so I, I used to draw these, this, this fella right here uh, which is actually uh, supposed to be me uh, and I would draw it all over the office where uh, me and Evelyn um, uh, used to work at. Uh, so that's a story for another day, but uh, I'll let her tell it. Um, so I wanted to draw her because I would draw her these messages and put these little notes everywhere. And I would put uh, him, and I also had a drawing of her, uh, but I haven't seen her drawing in a, in a long time. Uh, so I really couldn't recall it. Uh, but this little drawing of myself, I, I did before I met her. Uh, it was just a little doodle that I would always uh, uh, do in some of my work. Um, so I wanted to draw him again, kind of for nostalgic reasons. And then I took um, stickers from the Happy Memory Keeping Holidays uh, sticker book, um, which you'll see uh, shortly. I am making, I'm drawing right there my hand holding a bouquet of flowers uh, and I wanted to not draw the flowers, I wanted to use the stickers uh, from that uh, sticker book and add the flowers uh, from there to give it a more realistic feel. Um, so as you can see, I'm, I was having trou trouble with the perceptions. I, now, when about 15, 12 years ago, I used to be able to draw him uh, uh, with ease um, but I, I kind of just moved on right there and um, I added the Valentine's Day so I drew them on Valentine's Day and that sticker also comes from the happy memory keeping uh, holiday sticker book um, so I was centered there and as you can see I'm now starting to put the flowers there to represent the bouquet so when she sees it on that day it's uh, I can uh, give her real flowers and then she'll have these eternal flowers on the uh, on her little happy planner book here um, so then I started to kind of think ahead as like okay well I have this big space right here on the right of it and I wanted to do something else uh, to it so there's a couple of pauses here where I'm just thinking 
about some other things, but um, really what I wanted to do, my goal was to kind of balance uh, giving her some positive messages, uh, some encouraging messages uh, with some of the stickers here. That's something that I think that, uh, that the sticker books really have or a bunch of uh, positive uh, messages in it. Um, so this sticker that I'm holding right there, I'm trying to find a place for it, it's the one that says, you did not wake up this morning to be mediocre. And I put it on Sunday because Sundays, you know, my wife is always on the, oh, I didn't get this done. I, I wish I had more time to do this. Um, so I just wanted to be really encouraging. And that sticker uh, is from the Choose Happy uh, sticker book. The the one in the on the Sunday sticker, the one about a mediocrity. So if you look down, uh, I'm starting to build a box, um, and that is coincidentally from the Happy Planner and Teresa Collins Be Happy Box a sticker book. Um, so, so that's a little meta right there for you. And I'm making a box um, <clears throat> because in it, as you will see, I wanted to write her a message uh, of Valentine's Day. When I completed the box, uh, I started to have some ideas of what I wanted to uh, write in my acoustic poem. Uh, and essentially, the acoustic poem is uh, just uh, every line um, starts off with the letter that uh, corresponds to, uh, to the title. Before I was writing it, I was trying to think of some ideas, so I wanted the, the whole entire uh, planner uh, spread right here to have a kind of a border, a heart border around it to kind of uh, encapsulate the, the, you know, the feeling of hey, this is a whole week should be dedicated to Valentine's Day and, and to my love. Uh, so from the same sticker book, uh, the Happy uh, Memory Keeping Holidays book, uh, and the Choose Happy book, I took uh, these little hearts. Uh, I think no, I think most of them are from the uh, Choose Happy, uh, if, now that I can uh, recall. And I just placed them around. So before I get carried away with the hearts, I wanted to go back and add some positive messages. So I took this um, Make Today Awesome sticker. Um, from one of the sticker books. This one comes from the um, Goals uh, Happy Planner sticker book. And I I put it underneath three days uh, and then I added the S to it because what I wanted was to emphasize the fact that uh, awesome is not just relegated to one day, but every day can be awesome. Uh, and uh, sometimes I think Evelyn um, uh, puts uh, an emphasis on how awesome a day has been, how productive it's been. But I wanted to, you know, tell her that there's things that she does outside of this that uh, make her awesome. So I went back to the poem, um, and again I started to write this poem uh, in my head as I was putting the stickers around there, and kind of getting ideas of what I wanted to write and what I wanted to say. Uh, and it's essentially just a little heartfelt. Uh, uh, poem about the way that uh, Eve makes me feel and um, why I appreciate her so much and I love her so much um, and I just wrote that so the the title I think you can see the title but I don't think uh, the whole entire uh, process like I said is in in the video uh, but um, I was just kind of like trying to put down like how can I stress how much she means to me and how she makes me feel so uh, fast forward that you can see the poem is done so I, then I went back and I wanted to put that uh, sticker that says uh, pretty important stuff here um, just to kind of emphasize that while the whole entire spread here her social media planner is important I didn't want her to lose uh, sight of uh, the personal importance that uh, she has uh, uh, in, in, in my, in my eyes, what she means. So I put that, and then I went back to, to putting the hearts, 
around it and uh, I wanted to really uh, give it that uh, you know homemade uh, Valentine's Day card feel uh, so these little hearts gave me that border like I said that uh, kind of uh, took me back to when, when I was a kid and I would make these little these little cards um, myself with some construction paper and some some glue and, and what have you um, so I just started uh, putting them, I think, all around. Uh, and I wanted to get to about one heart per day, but then uh, I just ran out of space and I couldn't space them out like I wanted to. Um, so I just uh, kept that with what I had. Um, and then I, I added um, just a couple of more on the side to kind of like balance them out. But I didn't want to go into her lines of you know, the conquering the one check at a time or random acts of kindness I didn't want to go in there so I just went a little bit around it uh, where she could still use that space and then um, like, like I said bulk of it is uh, me putting uh, these little heart stickers that I was just so obsessed with uh, in the meantime uh, the four sticker books that I used were the choose happy um, the goals uh, the Happy Memory Keeping Holidays and the Happy Planner and Teresa Collins Be Happy Box. Uh, that's where the stickers come from. Um, um, so there, I'm, this is where I'm counting them and I ended up with 25 and I was like, ah, oh, just fucking add four more. <laughs> it would be perfect representation of this month. But uh, it wasn't meant to be. And I think I'm starting to wind down right here um, of what I put down. I don't think there's another sticker that I put uh, other than the arrow uh, that you'll see in a minute that comes from the goals uh, sticker book. Um, and I wanted to kind of like point, you know, her attention to really focus on the, the poem and kind of get to it. But... Um, what I did instead was kind of um, write her a, a little question here uh, with the with my little drawing of myself, and you'll see in a minute um, that I that I put these final touches on this planner. But overall, I, I just I wanted to, like I said, find a balance and uh, be encouraging, um, kind of remind her of. You know that that she needs encouragement. I you know I don't see her in the daytime as I'm working and she's working from home. Uh, it's that final sticker. It's a little arrow that's pointing, um, and I just wanted to see it. And I know that she remembers it because I know that uh, she's kept so many of the little drawings of it, um, of it. Uh, but then I just give her a simple little question and say do you remember me uh, and hopefully it triggers a laugh and a chuckle <laughs> ah, there's so many things I am uh, the um, husband doc day as a well that's it I hope you've enjoyed the uh, presentation um, well you don't call it presentation uh, but I'm sorry that's a teacher speak I, uh, well anyway um Yes, the planner. Um, I think it's subscribe here. Uh, watch something over here. Uh, hey, ring that bell down there because uh, there's a lot of good stuff that's uh, coming. Uh, 2020 is going to be a really awesome year. Stay tuned. Bye. Come back later this week for a giveaway. Stay tuned.